grocery haul for today um, so I went to the store just to grab a couple things so uh, I grabbed a case of El Tofo mangoes it's the perfect time to grab them right now I'm guessing that wherever they grow well these ones are from Mexico I'm guessing that this is the in-season time because the texture is incredible so um, I grabbed a case I didn't know how much they were going to be individually they were three for five dollars and I thought, oh, I'm going to grab a case, and if it comes down to it, then I have to pay for, I don't know, nine or ten mangoes and bite the bullet on that. Well, uh, this case ended up being $7.99, so I paid less than a dollar per mango, which is really good for here in Ontario. Um, so I got the case of mangoes and two cucumbers and two bags of rice pasta. If you haven't had this rice pasta, um, because I am gluten-free, this is the best stuff. And I got one bunch of bananas. Now you'll see, oh wait, first trip. One bunch of bananas, one case of mangoes, these guys, these guys, and two bags of these organic yellow flesh potatoes. And they look incredible. The skin is super, super fine looking. And they're local, well, they're Canadian, Ontario. Um, yes, so that was my first trip in. And when I found out that the case of mangoes was only $7.99, I decided I should go back in. So that's where the other two bunches of bananas came from and the other two cases of mangoes. Uh, so in my first trip, where everything but this these four items, um, it was $30, $31. And the store that I go to, if you go between Monday and Thursday, if you spend $10 on produce, they give you a $10 gift card. Um, for those that are in Ontario, I'm not sure if Sobeys is outside of Ontario, but Sobeys does this at just the one location near us. Um, and then when I went back in, I decided, well, I should spend another $20. So I ended up getting two $10 gift cards. So next time I go to get groceries, if I spend that 20 bucks on produce, it's basically free. Um, so I'm really excited. Uh, so the second trip in was $21 with tax. Oh, and I also bought an apple and I have eaten the apple already. So uh, six pounds of organic potatoes, uh, many, many kilograms of mangoes, uh, bananas. If this was the prices of things, this is like a raw till four grocery haul uh, amazingness. Um, if I could do this all the time, I would. Uh, this would definitely by, be my mango to banana ratio. I much prefer the mangoes, but uh, I can only enjoy them for a short time a year. So anyway, that is all my stuff and uh, I'll see you guys a little later. Okay guys, so I just finished uh, a whole liter of water, just a little drop left there, and uh, first breakfast of the day is eight spotty bananas. Um, so this is about 800 calories, so good start to the day, and uh, I'll see you at the next meal. Hey guys, I just got out of the gym, and this is my post-workout meal that I prepared. Um, it's a little later than I planned for my lunch, but I planned my lunch before I went to the gym, and that's the best I can say I've done in the last couple weeks. So I'm gonna get through these six El Tofo mangoes, and I'll see you guys at the next meal. Okay guys, so I just finished teaching, and here is my third meal. Um, I've got, uh, I don't know, three or four cups of romaine lettuce here. And then about three cups of white rice with some sweet chili sauce and a splash of tamari. Um, I've just seen a lot of you guys on YouTube doing rice with sauce, keeping it simple. And it was the easiest meal to make. I already had the lettuce washed in the fridge and then made some white rice while I was getting ready for work. And I threw it in a container and now I get to eat, which is so exciting. 
Um, so far so good, just keeping things really simple today. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video so far. Um, I got home late from teaching last night and my final uh, meal of the day was, uh, it was late, I didn't feel like cooking so I stopped by Wendy's and I grabbed my regular um, two plain baked potatoes with some containers of salsa and I uh, came home and ate that in my pajamas and then went to bed just after 11, which is shocking for me. So that was my Monday video and I hope you enjoyed the uh, grocery haul from late last week as well. I wanted to squish it all together. Um, so the day finished off with just over 2,700 calories um, and it was a super low fat day. It was only like two or three percent. Um, which is really low fat, but I'm gonna let things kind of even out over the week. On the weekend, I made uh, a vegan mac and cheese which had some cashews in it. It was still pretty low fat, all things considered, but um, having that kind of thing in there just let some days get really low and some days are probably gonna be at like 15% and it'll all balance out in the end. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this What I Ate video and uh, don't forget to give me a little thumbs up and if you're not subscribing already, subscribe because I am around a lot more now and I uh, hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.